Hey, this is B from Kongs R Us, and here's another showcase video of the Arcade 1UP pinball mods you can do with a beautiful front end made by Mystery Encoder. He did it with this version 3 of this mod. You have Marvel Pinball, Star Wars Pinball, and Williams Pinball in this beautiful full screen image front and launcher that you can launch any of the tables from. He even hacked into the solenoid and sounds so it's firing the solenoids in the actual menu system itself. So let's go into a table for Marvel. This actually loads up the exact Marvel tables that you have in here. And one of the other major features that people were asking for is once you get into an actual game, can you exit back to the launcher menu? And the answer is yes. So let's just get into a table really quickly so you can see that this is running. This is Marvel Civil War on my Star Wars um, pinball machine. So this is running perfectly well. All the solenoids are firing and everything. That sounds great, plays great. This is still playing in 720p at the moment but there's even more features there. So that's pretty much the game plan. When you want to exit back to the launcher menu, you just press the two white buttons at the same time at the front, and this is going to relaunch it back to the main screen. So this is now built in for you to switch between any of your three tables between Williams, um, Star Wars, or the Marvel tables, which is fantastic. So again, you can get in here and play all your tables that you want to pretty pretty quickly. So this is freaking amazing. There's more in store that Mystery Coder has in mind for this build. He's uh, a big, the biggest a-hole you can think of, but um, he's been amazingly being able to put this together for the community, just for the sake of science to see this is, if this could, could be done. And so once you're back in the menu setting, I want to show you one last feature that he did, which is freaking awesome. You can now enable 1080p on your play field too. So right now we know this is 720p. If you hold down the left uh, white button on the front left side, hold it down for about five to 10 seconds and then let go. And then it's going to flicker a little bit and then it's going to restart the machine. And you see now the resolution has been forced to 1080p and it's gonna restart. So he rooted the device somehow, figured it out, and now is forcing 1080p resolution for the tables. Now I tested some of the Williams tables and there is a little bit of ball um, delay and and what what is it called? Um, some skipping frames, but the Star Wars tables actually look definitely much better than what I had before. The biggest offender of tables was the Boba Fett table where you can see all the different lines on the different tables and so now you can play the Star Wars and the Marvel tables pretty well in 1080p. This is force resolution that Mystery Coder did. I have no idea how he did it but now I'm running the 1080p version of Boba Fett Zen tables on here and you definitely can tell the difference uh, from the stock one, you don't see the jaggies as much on the flippers and the edges. If you look at Boba Fett himself, he has more detail. The color still isn't as vibrant as the PC version of these tables, the full FX3 versions, but the 1080p resolution definitely is a noticeable difference and you don't see any lag quality in the ball for this particular game. If you're actually in the Williams game tables, um, there is a little bit of, I would say, uh, frame skipping that's happening on the table. So the Williams tables has a little bit of a delay on the tables that I tested using the 1080p. You can even see when I'm navigating the menu, the menu feels a little bit slow when I'm playing the table. So let's run Attack on Mars. It's just running a little bit sluggish in the 1080p mode. So I don't recommend playing the Williams pinball pack in 1080p, but you can do it for um, the Star Wars tables. So yeah, if you're looking at the ball coming down here, even the flippers, you can tell they look a little bit laggy coming down so there's definitely some not smooth animations happening on the ball here but for the marvel tables and the star wars tables in 1080p they look good there's a little thing here that says 1080p enabled and if you want to go back to 720p you just hold that left flipper down again for about five to ten seconds let go and then it's going to flicker and then it's going to switch it back to the 720p it's going to enlarge it and then it's going to restart the image again one more time so this is pretty much it for the showcase video of the new pinball hack if you want to call it whatever it is mystery coder thank you very much you are the biggest a-hole in the entire community world but we love you for showing us what's been possible with the rk one up pinball we can't wait to see what else you have in store because even the GUI had a little secret code that i saw there so if you guys see it 
find out what it does. Uh, this is amazing to check out this new front end. Thanks so much. See you next time.